Is the White House trying to block out the sun? What? Of course not. But it was mandated to do research on how to refract small amounts of incoming solar energy to slow down the climate crisis with a thing called solar radiation management technology, also known as solar geoengineering. This kind of technology can be deployed in three different ways. By injecting aerosol into the stratosphere, spraying marine clouds with microscopic sea salt crystals to make them more reflective, and ground level albedo enhancement, which is a fancy way to say make more surfaces on Earth reflect by painting them white. This is a very niche reference, but have you seen the movie Geostorm starring Gerard Butler? This reminds me of it. An innovative solution turns destructive and dangerous. By the way, experts are calling it dangerous and even unethical. The deployment of solar geoengineering could have effects on weather patterns, agriculture, and availability of food and water. Now, I have to emphasize that the White House is only researching this and does not have any active plan on deploying it. So this could very much just stay in the realm of science fiction. 